What's up Dragon Nation? I'm Rich with Dragon Nation Gaming. Welcome to Dark and Light. So it's been about, I think it's been about two years since I've actually played this game. Uh, last time I played that setup was going to take a break for about a year just to allow the game to advance a little bit and I completely forgot about it. Yeah, this game is pretty much dead. There are still some people that play it, but yeah, not a whole lot. Uh, apparently there is a lot in the game that has changed. I, I really want to get in and see how much it's improved. Now after two years, I'm expecting a lot, but we'll have to see how that works out. Alright, so the first thing we need to do is we need to select, I think this is your uh, class. So I think the eagle is human. The unicorn... I guess that's a unicorn. It looks like a unicorn. Uh, the unicorn are elves and the dragon are dwarves. So I kind of like the elves. We'll go with the elves real quick. And that's going to start us down in the south. Where does this one start us? Oh, in the west. And this one starts us in the north. All right. So one thing I have found out, which does kind of suck, is the spawn points have changed. As you can see, I have died. So that way I could check it out. And yeah, the old spawn points are gone, it looks like. Which is unfortunate because, yeah, I'm going to miss them. But anyways, let's go ahead and select the elves. And now I need to make a character. And you know, of course, I'm going to be going for female. So this is going to take me a little while. Let's go ahead and get the uh, character created. Alright, so I think this is the character I'm going to go with. Kind of looks alright. So the, uh, this game has the same developers as Ark Survival Evolved, but of course the artwork and everything else is a little bit different. I kind of prefer this game to Ark Survival Evolved when it comes to the artwork. Well, some of it. Some of it was actually pretty bad, uh, especially the animals. The animals were kind of robotic in the way that they moved but I'm curious to get into it and see just how much has changed but yeah this one looks pretty good so I think we're gonna go with her all right start game Arwen yeah screw it let's just go with the default name and okay I guess we Oh, it's an eagle, so I guess we uh, spawned in a human territory, and of course we spawned in when it's dark. Not cool. All right, let's, uh, find it. It's got a heart right here, so I guess we get health? Yeah, we get health from here, okay. Uh, fire, I guess we can cook stuff in here. Yep. Uh, what else? Oh, oh, shit, I forgot about these. Yeah, we can dodge and stuff. All right. Which is going to be useful when we're trying to tame or trying to fight. All right, so here's a merchant. What is he? Okay, we need gold for all that. And of course, what is this? Oh, this is all the stuff he sells. Okay. <laughs> Why does he have Hi. a poor a Quinho Luva? Whatever the fuck that is. And that's a rune. I think that's a rune. That's a rune. Alright. Uh, yeah. Guess that's all there is to that. Uh, ooh. Water. Okay, I can't see what can it. I do for you? Damn thing. So, yeah. What is it for the map? Is it M? No? How about inventory? Do I not? I can't... Huh. No map. House manager, monster list. House of Arwen, okay. Oh, yeah, the monster list. I forgot about this. Well, it's that, it actually looks like they added a bunch of creatures. Light elemental. Yeah, it looks like there's a lot more creatures than there was before. Huh. Not a whole lot, though. Is there different categories? No. 
Mythical, dark, elite, normal, and your own animals. Uh, there is one that was pretty gigantic. What can I do for you? Uh, it was one that they were about to add when I stopped playing the last time. But I have no idea which one it is. Oh, there's even water creatures now. Oh, Frost Dragon. You know, at some point I'm going to be trying to tame those. Now, I don't know how many episodes I'm going to play this game. We'll just have to see. All right. I mean, first episode, I guess we'll see how it goes. And if I'm enjoying myself in this episode, we'll continue on. Are you just an archer? Yeah, you're just an archer. Uh, yeah, we got water. There's some more water over there. So we have stuff to survive in the... What the hell? What the hell are you wearing? Okay, it's a it's a guard, but <laughs> what the hell? I have no clue. <laughs> That's well, that was weird. So yeah, I kind of I kind of miss the old spawns a little bit, uh, especially the uh, dwarven stronghold. That's where I used to always spawn. It was it was beautiful. Oh, and all the animals are sleeping. Is that new? I can't remember. I don't think the... Oh, what the hell are you? Are you a mean guy? He looks like he'll be mean. Uh, a wild Kibo. Okay, he's not attacking me, so... Defensive herbivore. So, no. So, stun tameable, so I have to stun him in order to tame him. And I'll have to figure out the taming again because I completely forgot- oh shit. Oh shit. The pigs are attacking. Get away from me, fat boy. Yeah, you're a fat ass pig. Alright, hold on. Get away from me, you little shit. Oh, now- oh shit, now I got three of them. God damn it, would you little bastards leave me alone? Go away. Shoo. Shoo pig. Alright, so the run mechanics are a little... I don't know. Uh, the characters, the run mechanics and all that, the animations... They're a little too anime. But, you know, I guess. Whatever. Alright, so... Uh, we do have quests that we can get. So, oh, oh, here we go. All right, so this one has one of 21 quests and it's the basic just starter quest. So we'll go ahead and- First, you must learn to harvest yeah. what you need from your surroundings in order to survive. Find some bushes, trees, or even some barrels and strike them to gather useful items. Okay, well, oh, hey. Uh, Snowy Fox. Oh, you're cute. Yeah, those are new. I've never seen those before. <laughs> cute little bastards. Uh, I'm guessing... Yeah, put Timmy food in last item slot to feed. Yeah, so they're a passive tame. Alright, let's go ahead and venture out a little bit and see... Oh, shit. Okay, like... We're loading in. How are you today? How are you? Oh wow, okay. Let's go uh, let's go to the edge and see what we can see. Well, not a whole hell of a lot. Where is hold on. Uh back in the day we used to have a moon that looked like it was shattered. But it was a skybox, but I'm not seeing it. What the hell is that? Thought I saw yep, yeah, there it is. What what is that? Well, I guess we'll have to explore at some point and find out what that is. And... Oh. Shit. Okay. More world loading in. Alright, so let's go ahead and go through the missions real quick. Uh, so harvest a bush, is it? Oh, left mouse button. Alright, so we got enough straw. We also need berries and shards. Alright, so now we need shards. 
There we go. Alright, so rune... Oh, the rune of light! I forgot about this. This one's actually kind of cool. It's this one. Oh, we already have some, actually. But yeah, we need to craft it to do the mission. Now, this one is a cute little pixie or fairy, whatever you want to call it, that follows you around and provides light. Yep, there she is. Yeah, she just dances around you kind of like a little companion and just gives you light whenever you're in the dark. For you. Completely forgot about that. All right, let's, uh, can I dodge forward, please? Dodge. Dodge. No. All right, there's left. All right, dodging seems to be a little quirky. All right, next one. Harvest stone to upgrade melee knowledge. Well, unfortunately, I don't think I can make an axe yet. Uh, okay, so I can add... Let's go ahead and add to weight. Oh, yeah, we could do two. So, weight and attack. And then knowledge to unlock stuff. We need... Uh, which one is it? Oh, there it is. Alright, so we need to get... Oh, no, that's not it. Where's, uh, melee? All right, so this is the one we need to get to. Uh, how do we get that? Uh, craft tools, craft weapons, and collect stone. Well, um, yeah, I don't think we could do that. Also, uh, by attacking as well. It's going to close that out. So, what I should do is go ahead and find some more bushes and just harvest the hell out of them. Yeah, in the bottom left-hand corner, right underneath our uh, mission... There we go. 100%. So we did get an upgrade. Alright, now we can go ahead and make the axe. Oh, and also gave us a pair of paints, too. There we go. Ooh, hello. Oh, yeah. She looking good. Alright, let's go ahead and grab the axe. And now we need to get wood from tree with stone axe or get stone from rock. Okay. Come on, let me up. We need five of each. All right, there's the stone. Let's go ahead and get the wood. All right, next mission is to eat berries. Do I, yeah, I do have some. And I need to eat five of them. So one, two, three, four, five. Uh, unlock staff knowledge rank one. Okay, I need to figure out how to do that. Alright, so let's go ahead and upgrade weight again and attack. Alright, knowledge. Where is... Oh, there we go. So how do we upgrade you? Collect wood or craft a stack? So let's go ahead and grab some wood. And do I still have my axe? Yes, I do. Alright, so now... Now we can make a staff. Alright. And I guess we'll put you down in number four. All right, now we need a craft magic extraction staff head. Oh, we already have it. Cool. Oh, and it also gave us a pair of boots. There we go. All right, so now I think... Does it automatically arm? I think it automatically arms. No? No? Oh, I gotta, hmm, I gotta equip a primitive staff without the, the head, the head on it. All right, so I guess I have to make another staff. God damn it! All right, staff craft. It's all right though. We'll put that down number three, and there we go. Yeah, I'm kind of getting ahead of myself with some of the stuff. It's. God damn, she's kind of cute. Anyways. Alright, so we need to drain magic shards from trees or drain magic shards from rocks. Well, both. Alright, so let's grab our staff. And time to... Oh, there we go. Four, five, nine, and ten. Alright, now I need to eat a flower. Do I have any? Yes, I do. 
All right, so let's go ahead and in number zero, need to eat two. Okay, uh, upgrade melee knowledge to rank two. Can I make a sword yet? No, I cannot. All right, let's get rid of, now let's leave you in number four. Uh, can I do melee with the staff? Uh, no. How about on tree? Nope, that gives a survival. So I guess what I need to do is I need to, nope, I need to get rid of you. Four, there we go. Uh, I need to harvest with hand. Okay, no, that gave us water magic. But damn, I'm getting a lot of freaking berries. Alright, so I'm not upgrading melee. Let's try... Let's try beating the hell out of a tree, I guess. Oh, there we go. We're at 50%. Alright. I guess it's going up really, really slow. Let's try a different tree. Maybe a bigger tree? Maybe... Maybe a bush. Let's try a bush. And I definitely don't want to hit that guy. He will owe me. There we go. Now melee is going up. So we're at 60. Uh, survival just went up. So did cooking. But I need to get my melee up. Okay, now we're at 70. Ooh. Yeah, don't want to hit him. Alright, there's 80... 85 95 Come on All right, I need more pushes And 100 there we go All right, so we're gonna need a stone pickaxe and a stone sword So craft and craft All right, the pickaxe will put down a number one, and the sword put down a number three. Oh, and we also got a rune of gravity, a magical rune imbued with the element of air that can slightly decrease the weight of the items in your inventory. Oh, okay, well, it's automatically giving me stuff. And also, I got some meat as well. Which reminds me, I need to check my food and water. All right, let's go ahead and put the foot down on number nine. And I thought I saw some water up here in the base. Uh, where's the entrance? Over here. So yeah, there is a little bit of lag whenever an area loads in. What are you? Oh, did I just, yeah, it just made me eat. Oh, and it makes my health go up, okay. All right, Drake. Hi. Hi. I think we're good. All right, so with the pickaxe, we need to harvest uh, sulfur from rocks, uh, twine from trees with the sword, and then flowers from a bush with the sword. Okay. So there's the sulfur, and now we need to get our sword on a tree. And then we're gonna need a bush as well because we need flowers. So let's try this one. All right, three. Okay, I need three more. Okay, there we go. Now I need to ha harvest sulfur to gain fire knowledge experience. All right, let's go ahead and grab our pick. All right, there we go. Uh, unlock fire magic knowledge rank 2. Alright, let's go ahead and add to our weight and then attack again. Uh, shit, what was it? Hold on. <laughs> shit. Come on, close out. Uh, fire magic knowledge. So, fire magic. Uh, in order to get that, I need to harvest sulfur 
Or craft fire magic. Alright, so I guess we're going to be harvesting sulfur for a little bit. Oh, nope. Give me my pick. There you go. Alright, so we're at 50. So it looks like it gives me... 4? For every 4th hit. So it gives me 1 per hit. Okay, maybe more. Alright, there's 88, 94, and 100. There we go. Now we need to craft a fireball staff head. Okay, is this one? Craft. Alright, does it automatically... No. Do I need to equip it? No. Okay, hold on. How about if I go like that? There we go. Alright, so now what I need to do is kill a creature and harvest meat for, from it. Okay, Mr. Pig. You guys attacked me earlier. Time for you to get owned. Oh, shit, run away. Oh, that was simple. Alright, now I need to harvest the meat. And there we go. Alright, so it looks like those quests are done. Well, that didn't take a whole lot. Uh, I still don't have a chest piece. To oh, it gave me one. Okay. What is this? Rare raw meat. Okay, I got that from a pig. But yeah, there was a fire up here, so we can go ahead and cook. And I'm encumbered. So let's go ahead and go to O and... Can I do all these at the same time? No? How about... Stable and durable. Foundations are the groundwork no, I can for only your do base. One at a time. Okay. Be sure to craft enough before you begin your base construction. Alright, where's that fire? There it is. So yeah, we can go ahead and get that, uh... Get that meat cooked. Somewhere. There it is. How about this one? Alright, craft all. I don't think I can cook that. Why not? Oh, I guess not. Oh well. Alright, so what do we need to do? We need to harvest twine to unlock range right. crafting something. Alright, so what do I do with number... Alright, so what we're going to need is... Is it the sword? I think it's faster. Oh no, it's on trees. My bad. So, let's see how much we get with the sword. Two, five, six, eight. Alright, let's try the hatchet. Alright, one. Let's try... Is that the hatchet or the axe? That was the axe. Let's try the hatchet. Alright, so the pickaxe gives us five at a time. And I'm definitely encumbered. Let me see if I can level up. Yeah, let's go ahead and put some into weight. And attack. And that didn't help for shit. Alright, let's see. I need to find a tree. Uh, we need to double check and make sure that the uh, pickaxe really is a little bit faster. Uh, because that's going to be very important later to see which tool is better for getting resources. Ooh, lag. Stuff loading up. So yeah, I guess the first thing I'm going to be taming is one of these longhorns. I can't remember if we could ride them. So yeah, that's one of the things we'll have to test out and see. Alright, so the pickaxe does get me a lot more twine. Uh, craft throwing knives. Okay. Uh, I think it's that one. Yep. Oh, and I got some on me. Okay. Now what? 
Uh, equip throwing knives. Okay. Oh, and the quest is complete. That was it? Really? Alright, what do we want to go? We want to go... I guess this one's probably going to be building, so let's go cooking. Fancy cookware doesn't make a chef a good chef. A good chef can come up with a tasty dish out in the wild with the help of a nice campfire. Mm. <laughs> the, uh, the voice acting. Okay, uh, so... It just says campfire. I'm guessing we need to craft one. So, craft. Okay, then we're probably going to have to place it. Let's see. Alright, set up a campfire. Can I place it here? Uh, then we need to cook some meat. Do I have meat on me? Yes, I do. Alright, do I need to grab the meat, maybe? I think I need to... Oh, no, I need to tell a craft all. There we go. And then when it's done, I guess I need to grab one for that one to be done. Let's see. I don't know. I'm trying to figure this whole thing out. So yeah, we still have a really long way to go in this game. We just barely started. I mean, first episode, we're not going to be barely... Gra uh, we're not going to be scratching the surface at all. Alright, so I guess I need to get more berries. Where is that berry bush? I just saw one. Yeah, I just passed one. There it is. Alright, there we go. That was all I needed. Uh, craft spice meat? What? Oh, probably in the campfire. Alright, let's go ahead and put out fire. Uh, let's go ahead and take all. How do I do spiced meat? Is it going to tell me? No, that's berry jam. Uh, pff, shit, no clue. Oh yeah, I definitely need to get some storage up. Alright, so I did have some meat cooking in the fire that's over there, so we'll see. I don't know, maybe... Oh, we can harvest. Oh, coins! Awesome! Yeah, we get coins from the barrels. I forgot about that. Alright, there's some more barrels around here. We'll go ahead and check that out here in a little bit. But how do I make spiced meat? Alright. I have no clue. Uh, okay, so berry jam I can make in my inventory, so. Uh, we need to craft five of those. Hi. Alright, so that should make five. Yep. Uh, where the hell's the spiced meat, though? Uncommon wood, a simple grill used to roast turkey. What can I do for you? Do I need to make make that? What do I need for it? Uncommon wood, copper ore, and campfire. Yeah, I'm not gonna be making that. Uh, so how do I make spiced meat? I haven't a clue. I really have no clue. Let's go ahead and go. Uh, knowledge probably. Uh, cooking, melee, offhand, ranged, farming, cooking. There we go. Uh, spice meat. There we go. Uh, so is it unlocked? How do I make it? It can only be crafted at campfire or public campfire, stone fireplace. So we could do it at the campfire, but I guess it's open. We unlocked it. But I'm not seeing. Yeah, I'm not seeing spiced meat. What can I do for you? Well, uh, I guess it lied to me. 
Maybe I need to upgrade my cooking just a little bit more. Let's see. Alright, so we're at... Uh, shit. Need to go to cooking. Oh, so it's rank 2, so I need to upgrade it. Gotcha. Alright, so I need to harvest meat, cook food or drinks, and craft cooking items. Alright, so we did cook a little bit of meat, so I need to get my, uh, I guess I need to kill some more stuff and get that up. Hi. Hi. Alright, let's go ahead and grab that. Did that up my cooking at all? No. Yeah, it looks like I need to kill some more animals. Well, this is gonna be fun. And I do have some meat over here as well. You know, we got the longhorns. I think they might spawn a little bit more. Let's go ahead and see how hard it is good, uh, to kill those guys. All right, four. Four. Why can I not, huh? Uh, craftable, craftable sorcerer staff. Okay, uh, let's get you down there. There we go. All right, I gotta kill both. Come on, juke them, juke. Okay, they got me. <laughs> All right, so, yep, I died. It was a really bad idea to attack them. All right, Western. Uh, respawn at Western Outpost. Oh, do I still have all my stuff? No. Uh, okay, where's my body? Okay, Mr. Pig, do not attack me. I think I died. Yeah, here's my campfire. Nothing in there. Oh, yeah, that's right. I grabbed everything. Uh, okay, where did I die? Did I not? I thought I died like, oh, hold on. Oh, I did kill him. All right. So yeah, now I need to harvest the meat. So take off. And we got uncommon meat as well. So yeah, cooking is going up. 75, 79, 83, 85, 86, come on, come on, ah, we should be able to do it with this guy, 95, 98, 100, there we go, let's go ahead and finish him off, alright, now we can make spiced meat, gotcha, and we only need to make one, god damn, how much meat you got on you? Yeah, I'm definitely going to need a house. I'm going to need storage. Where's my campfire? There it is. Oh, wait. What did that do? I held on... Oh, when you hold it, it gives you the information. Okay. All right. So we need... What do I need to make that? Uh, berry jam and cooked meat. All right. Cooked meat. Berry jam? Where did my jam go? There it is. And... Wait a minute. Oh, I gotta turn on... I gotta turn on the fire. Hold on. Oh, I need wood. Duh. Alright, light fire. Spice meat. Uh, craft item. And I guess that's gonna give us a little bit more... A little bit more health. Alright, so take off. And there we go. Another level up. And it looks like the... Uh, yeah, the quest is done. So it looks like we have another one that's for grinding. And then we have another one that's for outposts. That would probably be building a hut. Holy shit. Wow. Okay. Ooh, hello. Queen of Venom looks kind of hot. Well, except for the snake hair. Damn. Okay. Oh, yeah. There are a lot more quests than there were before. Yeah, it's going to take quite some time to finish all these. 
But anyway, so yeah, first episode, uh, we just went around the game a little bit just to see what was up with it. I don't know. I think I'll make a couple more episodes. I need to get rid of my dead body. Uh, I'll probably go ahead and make a couple more episodes just to see how much the game has changed. It looks like the animals... Can I harvest you? Okay, I can harvest my own body. Cool. Uh, the animals aren't as robotic as they used to be. I mean, it used to be pretty freaking bad. I mean, I played this game when it first came out, so of course they're not going to be that great. But the worst ones were the uh, animals that fly. So that will be the real test to find... Uh, I have no idea what they were called. I think it was the uh, two-headed vulture was the first one you could get. That's the easiest one. Can't really remember though. We'll have to figure that one out. Uh, but yeah, we still have a whole lot to do. Ooh, hello. Yeah, that that's not ominous at all. Uh, so yeah, we still have a really long way to go. I, I think I'll probably play a couple of episodes of this game. Well, play a couple of episodes. Record a couple of episodes of this game just to, so we can get a little bit more information. You guys can see if you want to go ahead and uh, come back to the game if you played it before. Or uh, for those of you who are looking for a new game to play. Uh, if you've never played this game before, I'd, I'd recommend getting it. I mean, it will give you a few hours of gameplay. If not more. Alright, let me see if I can get over here so we can actually check some stuff out. Uh, so I can't wait to get into the world and do some exploring, see how big the world is. Uh, see what new creatures they've added to the game. Maybe new mechanics. It looks like we got some metal right there. Uh, hopefully some new mechanics that we haven't seen before. But yeah, we'll worry about all that in the next episode. Until then, make sure to like and subscribe, all that good stuff. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.